it isn't always easy to get on with people, is it? Sometimes we feel we do everything we can to be on good terms with other people and yet the way they treat us we either feel unseen or unacknowledged or unappreciated and we become disenchanted about the relationship because well you know the thing we are in a relationship for is to feel that the other is loyal to us, that they see us, that they believe us, that they stand by us, that they are with us, on our side, not against us, not absent, not critical, not lacking in warmth or acknowledgement for the problems we're going through. So this is what happens a lot in relationships, you know, sometimes on both sides, but very often on just one side, we feel wronged, we feel let down, we feel abandoned, we feel we haven't been met, we haven't been seen, we haven't been wanted. And we become very sad about that, because when we've opened our hearts to other people, we expect reciprocation. And when there isn't reciprocity, we feel really out in the cold vulnerable on our own. So this is one of the things we really need to learn to deal with. We need to learn to deal with this getting closer to people when it's safe and removing ourselves when it isn't safe and yet to keep trying. Maybe we have misunderstood the other person, maybe we have been cold ourselves, maybe we have been critical, maybe we haven't always been as available as we should be. So certainly questioning ourselves should always be the first port of call. And when we keep scrutinizing ourselves, then we also need to scrutinize the relationship. You know, how much is there of give and take in it? How much openness has there been in it? And if we really come to the conclusion that this other person isn't ever going to be there for us, isn't really going to build that fire that is a friendship, that is a relationship. If they're not doing their part in it, then it really is much better to notice that sooner than later and to move on and to find people we do feel warmth from and we do feel we can share with and we do feel supported by. So the stronger we get, of course, the more we can take on board and the more we can actually keep finding solutions in relationships that go wrong. But initially, when we don't feel that strong, when we're still very vulnerable and fragile, it's really very important to keep ourselves safe. Never to expect too much, never to give too little, but never to give too much either. We need to constantly keep track of that. Keep it on an even keel. Keep it reciprocal, keep it being equal, keep it being fair. And make sure that you give as good as you get, but that indeed you always set out to give as much as possible until you know that it isn't safe to do so. Be well in your relationships and never give up on them.